Thank you for watching the Shikama Live Show with your host Shikama McDonald's to close 700 stores. That's more stores than it's opening for the first time in 40 years. For the past several months, McDonald's and its new CEO, Stephen Easterbrook, have attempted to initiate a turnaround for the slumping golden arches, including earmarking nearly 700 stores for closure. As a result of these measures, the company's footprint is expected to shrink for the first time in nearly four decades. That is, according to the new analysis from the Associated Press that looked at McDonald's regulatory filings and found that the fast food giant plan to close more stores than it opens this year makes 2015 the first non-growth year for the company since it's at least 1970. McDonald's filings with the Security and Exchange Commission SEC only started reporting store numbers in 1970. The AP theorizes that the company has hadn't actually slowed its growth since the mid-1950s. A spokesperson for McDonald's declined to provide a year for which the company last shrank and couldn't commit to on specific number of stores closing this year or whether it was more than the 700 announced previously. However, the company says the reduction is minimal when compared to the 14,300 McDonald's restaurants in the U.S., the closing stores will be a mix of franchise and company-owned locations. The closures are part of a strategic review intended to set the stage for future growth, the spokesperson said. The AP report reports that the shrinking footprint of the company is in stark contrast to the rapid expansion it has become known for. Industry analysis say that the once unstoppable growth of the chain liked lied to a natural overconfidence despite chains like Chipotle gaining customer love. Thank you for watching the Shikama live show. And of course, that means 700 stores, probably 20 people a store. You do the math of how many jobs will be lost. Thank you for watching the Shikama live show.